Today I'm preparing for a design session. We've got joining us um, a doctor, an occupational therapist, social work lecturer, digital expert and Helen, my co-production partner. And we've come together to think about how we can build on the Trusted Assessor course that's widely available. And this is a course that helps people, particularly people in reablement, learn about um, what equipment and adaptations um, are helpful for people. And we want to see if we can build on that to explore um, the contribution of digital and assistive technology um, and also thinking about individual and community assets and whether we can bring all that together into one course or, or learning experience. So our primary reason for doing it is so that in each team we can have a well-being trusted assessor who's able to have the what matters conversation, to find out what's working and not working for people, to look at both their assessed outcomes and their personal priorities, and then use the support sequence to help address that. And the support sequence starts with self-care, so things like health coaching or information or advice that the person might need to feel confident and competent um, in managing their long-term condition. And it also includes looking at digital and assistive technology. For example, are the ways that Alexa can be useful um, and the digital technology that's available to all of us. Then we look at friends, family, community, community circles. What assets are available in the local community that the person might be able to use? Um, making sure they're making the best use of statutory and universal services. And then where wellbeing workers could be helpful. So, we do all that as part of our initial conversation, but we want to make sure that our team are really well equipped to do that and also then to see whether we could create a course that other people might find useful, whether that's social workers, occupational therapists or health colleagues. And I guess fundamentally, we're trying to deliver personalised care and support planning um, in, a, in a very, very different way and create opportunities for everybody to learn how to do that. So uh, excited to see what might be possible and I'll let you know how we get on.